I can't seem to find anything about wave height. I know that 40 meters wave is 40 meter long, but what is the height? This is from I'm One Dead Money, okay, and it's about understanding the radio frequency spectrum. He says, is the height of the wave variable, or is there an exact height to length variable that is constant? The answer is, doesn't work that way. Now, if you're out watching the waves come in, wash in, you'll see that there is a kind of a periodicity to them as they come in. They come in at fairly regular intervals, okay. But the crest of the wave, these are pressure waves, the crest will go up and down. Now, sound is a pressure wave too, but it's this way, closer to you, closer to me, and so on. And so in the direction of the sound, you're getting a pressure wave that goes out that is going this way, not up and down like a seawater wave, but back and forth like that. Now, the uh, electromagnetic wave is very often almost universally depicted as a sine wave. That's a crutch because these waves travel linearly. Remember, a wave and a photon are kind of interchangeable. Photons travel in straight lines. So electromagnetic waves, at least the part that hits you, is coming to you in a relatively straight line, although, of course, it can be refracted by just about anything. But the wave itself is, if you think of an electromagnetic field, it comes to you and it reaches a point where it's maximum voltage, then it comes along a little further, it's minimum voltage, maximum, and so on. And so you see all these maxima and minima coming toward you. They don't wiggle up and down. They are variations in the voltage, and that variation in the voltage travels at the speed of light uh, toward you, okay? So if you want to think they're more like sound waves than ocean waves, but they're still not the same thing. They are getting stronger, weaker, stronger, weaker, stronger, weaker as they go past any single point, okay? Or something that can receive them. At RF, the photons are, oh, one physicist friend once explained it to me as great big fluffy photons, but it takes an antenna about a dipole in length, half wave, okay, to properly capture one of these waves. You can go either way you want to go because it's power not, power not. I know that's a little hard to visualize, but give it a try. Until we next meet, 73.